Hi guys, welcome to Football Lions. My name is Richman. In fact, guys, what a surprise signing from Chelsea. What a surprise, surprise signing, guys. In fact, no rumors, no information. Boom. Chelsea is about to pay 40 million. Boom. Renato Viega to do his medicals. Let's confirm it before we come and discuss or talk about this player, ladies and gentlemen. Renato Viega set to undergo medicals as new Chelsea player. Portuguese talent to sign contract valid until June 2032. Chelsea will pay 40 million to Basel and there will be no irons or sell on clause. Viega could also play as fullback in Chelsea plans. Exclusive story confirmed. So, guys, that is the information. But first, let's look at the player. Who is Reinaldo Viega? In fact, Reinaldo Viega is Portugal international. He is 20 years of age and he started his football career in a team called Sporting CB in Portugal. But in the year 2022, a team called Osbok in Germany signed him. So he went there, played one season, 2022 to 2023 season. After that season, a team called Basel or FC Basel signed him also. And he went to FC Basel and play another one season, 2023 to 2024 season. That was last season. So that is the club Chelsea is to sign him, FC Basel. And guys, the reason why Chelsea is signing this player, Mareska said he want a player who is versatile, versatility, a player who can play two or three positions at the same time. That is why Chelsea is going ahead to sign this player. He can play three good positions, but his primary position is defensive midfield or defensive midfielder as a player. But he can also play as center back and as left back. So, Chelsea is signing this player because of his versatility. And information saying that if Chelsea sign left footed center back or left footed defender, Chelsea may sell Chilwell and Chaloba. You remember? So, this guy is coming to replace two players. Chelsea is about to use one stone and kill two bears. Guys, he can play as DM, he can play as center back, he can play as what? Left back. So, that is the player Chelsea is signing. Renato Viega from Portugal. He is 20 years of age. And let's talk about his versatility. What I also like about this player, about his versatility, versatile nature. Playing so many numerical positions at the same time. In fact, in case we don't have our center back available, he can set in. We can put him there at the center back position and bring in another midfielder. Or in case we don't have left back available, we can send him to the left back position and bring defensive midfielder, his primary position. Last season, we suffered because of this problem. Thiago Silva was playing every game. And we sometimes we need to raise him as an old man. But he was playing every game. So, Jesse is about to solve that problem. Yes, he can play as center back, left back, and his primary position, defensive midfielder. So, guys, that is the player, Ronaldo Viega from portugal and in fact another thing i like about this young man in fact guys set pieces set pieces is very good in taking free kicks and modern football set pieces are very very important if you can utilize your set pieces in modern game some games you win it and don't deserve to win it because you are good in set pieces and that is what renaldo viaga can do best in terms of free kicks it doesn't look like a defender or defensive midfielder. He's very good. Spot on. When he, when he kicked the ball. Put his legs under the ball. In fact, nobody is preventing it. Not the goalkeeper. Not the defenders. Not the wall. It is going straight to the back of the net. I watched his videos. In fact, I was super happy. Our sporting directors are doing marvelous little job. Guys, they are doing super job. Signing talented young players. Let's hope in the future they don't sell them. If they sell these players in the future, then there, there will be a problem. But if it happened that, guys, they don't sell these players, we are going to work with them three to four seasons to come. In fact, Chelsea is going to be unforgivable. We are going to be fearless. Any team that we get, we are going to beat him. Woto, woto. Yes, guys. So let's hope Chelsea keep these players for, 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 for a very long time. So that they can gel together. They can build the chemistry. They combo together. 
so that we are going to be a good team. So guys, that is a player, Ronaldo Viega, very good in set pieces, having the versatility. He can play three positions, defensive midfielder, center back, and left back. And Chelsea is about to pay, or Chelsea is going to pay 14 million for him. And he's in London about to do his medicals. So guys, let me hear from you about this player. Are you happy? Would you like Chelsea to sign him? Renato Viega. Let me hear from you under the comment section. And let's move to the next topic. But before we go to the next transfer, guys, please just remind you to subscribe. Like this video to go far. At least 8 likes will do. And please don't forget to subscribe. And this is the next transfer. In fact, this one is about confirmation. Or official, a new preseason friendly. Chelsea versus Inter Milan. And it will play on 11 August. Yes, 11 August. And that will be, yes, I think that will be our last preseason game before we start the season. So, confirm and that game will play in Stamford Bridge. That is a picture or the picture you are watching on the screen, ladies and gentlemen. It will play on 11 August. And the season will start on 19th August. Yes. So this will be our last game versus Inter. Good team, big team, strong team. Yes, that will show how our guys prepare for the season. Yes, this game, I can't wait to watch it. That will show how our guys prepare for the next season. Yes, we'll get to know whether we are prepared or not. Or whether our new signings, Magai, Kellyman, Keenan, and now Ronaldo Viega, will see them all play and see how they can do their best for us. So guys, that is a new feature. Pre-season game, pre-season friendly. It will play in Stamford Bridge. Chelsea versus Inter Milan. And let's go to the next topic. In fact, this one, just like that player. Information saying that, just who still want to sign a winger. Right winger or left winger. Guys, but this player name is being mentioned internally in Chelsea grounds. Breaking Mitoma is like internal at Chelsea. Breaking Mitoma is like internal at Chelsea. So guys, that is the information. In fact, Mitoma from Brighton. <laughs> you, you remember him. His first season in the Premier League. <laughs> he was super good. Dribbling, scoring, taking on defenders. He was very good. That was, I think that was 2022-2023 season. His first season. Because of them and Liverpool, I can still remember Brighton and European sport on that season. And Chelsea like him in turn. Or Chelsea is, Chelsea is talking about him. They haven't submitted any official buy. Mitoma, guys. And he's 27 years of age. Yes, he's 27 years of age. But last season, injuries did not help this young man. Injuries did not help him. But would we like Chelsea to sign him? Guys, let me hear from you. For our winger position. Or for our wing position. Would you like Chelsea to sign him? Because information saying that. Chelsea is speaking about him on the grounds. Chelsea is discussing about him. So, would you like Chelsea to sign him? Very good player, having the dribble, having the skills. But, I think he's becoming an injury-prone player. So, guys, this is the player Chelsea is interested in again. Mitoma from Brighton. And you know our relationship with Brighton. So, if Chelsea want any player from Brighton, don't be surprised. It may happen. <laughs> We've been signing Brighton players. All these new owners came in. So, it won't be a surprise if just sign him. But let me hear from you guys your decision and your opinion about this signing or this player. Mitoma should just go for him. Should just sign him, guys. And let's move to the next transfer. Also, in fact, this is another winger. But let's confirm it before we come and talk about it. Also, guys, Juventus consider price tag around 25 million for Aaron's included for Federico Chiesa as current deal expire in June 2025, not being extended. Juventus are prepared to sell Chiesa, who is currently not part of Thiago Mota plans, as confirmed yesterday. So, guys, that is a player. Federico Chiesa from Juventus. In fact, Juventus is ready to sell him 25 million. But Chelsea won a winger. And Chelsea is still discussing about him, talking about him internally. And when you look at this player, guys, in fact, very good in dribbling, good in finishing, having the experience. I think he's 26 or 27 years of age. And just we have a young squad, bringing experienced player will help us a lot. But he's injury prone player. That is the problem here. Guys, he's injury prone player. But apart from these injury situations of GSR, everything is good. It's good. <laughs> Especially the experience part I like most. Because having young players in your team, you need experienced players so that they can combine together. They can form a mixture. 
yes, experienced and young players, they will play good. Everything will be there. So that is what I like about this player. His, his experienced nature, Federico Chiesa. So guys, Chelsea is talking about him internally. Chelsea is discussing about him internally. And they are selling him 25 million plus arons. It's not a big money. And also the problem will be his wages. Will he like to take less than the 150 million or 150 million? Or not more than 150 million? That will be the problem because he's going to the end of his career. And players, when they are going to the end of their football career, they want big money to end with. And will Federico Chiesa accept that 150 million or below that 150 million? So guys, that would be the problem also. So let me hear from you. Would you like Chelsea to sign this player? Would you like Chelsea to sign Federico Chiesa? Guys, let me hear from you in the comment section. And let's go to another transfer also. Aaron and Simeno. In fact, latest information from him about Chelsea and Boca Juniors. Let's see it, guys. Chelsea accepted a request for Aaron and Simeno to stay at Boca Juniors for another year, although he can be recalled after six months. The sale is done for 14.1 million. So, guys, that is the information. In fact, Chelsea concluded the signing of Aaron and Semino. And he will stay in Boca Juniors for one year or six months. He can come to Chelsea in general transfer window. Or he can still stay there for another season. So, Chelsea accepted, agree with Boca Juniors. And Chelsea will pay 14 million or 14.1 million for Aaron and Semino. So, guys, now confirm. Chelsea sign him, but he will not join Chelsea this summer or this transfer window. He will stay with Boca Junior, and after six months or one year, he will come back to Chelsea, like the way Chelsea sign Gusto at Lyon. Chelsea sign Gusto. Gusto still play for one season at Lyon. Then the following season, he join us. And Gusto, <laughs> we don't have to say anything about Gusto again. Very good player, marvelous player. When Rich James was missing or when Rich James was injured, we didn't miss him a lot because Gusto was able to replace him very well. So, guys, that is the information for Aaron and Semenlo. Just to agree with Boca Jr. for him to stay for another six months or one year. And let me hear from you in all the transfers that we discuss about, guys. And please don't forget to subscribe. Like this video to go far. Until 70 less will do or 80 less will do. Take care. Peace.